Hi, this is George Dobbs, GC3 RJV, who's come all the way down from Manchester uh, uh, to visit the QRP in the Country event. Hello, George. Hello, Rob. Right. And um, lo looking at all bits and pieces, do you mind if I just briefly speak to George? Oh, sure. yeah, say, and George, would you like to show your book, the, um, uh, the um, Fanwood Radio? Fanwood Radio. Gilbert Davy, Fanwood Radio. Uh, I think first published in 1957, I think. This is the gentleman that um, wrote for the boys' own paper. That's right. Yeah. Yes, it was 1957, uh, during the time he was writing the boys' own paper. Um, this is the last edition, though, it's on the final or second one of the which is 1965. So it's quite long. remarkable, isn't it? Yeah. And uh, he's, he's describing stuff there which is not isolated from the mains, which uh, oh, yeah, I found oh, yeah, rather oh, yeah, interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you'd like to hold up a copy of Sprat there, George? This is Sprat, the small power. Now, uh, explain oh, the. It stands, uh, stands for Small Powered Radio Amateur Transmission. And uh, George has been associated and founded the, uh, the, uh, the GQRP club. How many years ago was that? Oh, 1974, I think. <laughs> George is now retired, but um, it is, it's still very, very active. And this magazine, I think it goes to virtually every country in the world, doesn't it? It does, it does. And, we, and we have a, a circulation of about 5,000. That's it, absolutely incredible. Well, thank you for coming down to the QRP in the country, George. And you and Joe have been made so welcome. And at least we're dry in here. We are, indeed. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay, thank you, George. Cheers. Thanks, Bye.